Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys. Whatever time y'all are tuning in, I certainly appreciate y'all are here. In today's video, guys, we're going to be working on a 1963 Camillus U.S. military knife. A demo knife, as some people say. We're going to be changing the blade. It's got a broke blade, the main blade. And then we're going to be opening a package all the way from California. How about that? And I also want to remind y'all about the giveaway Monday night, 6.30 p.m. That's April 15th. I'm going to be scheduling it sometime this weekend. You'll see it come up in the feed. Uh, but uh, it's going to be fun. So I can't wait to give that stuff away. Anyway, guys, I just want to thank y'all for tuning in today. And I hope you enjoy the video. Okay, here it is. See, it's got a broke blade right there. I would try to re uh, repair this blade because it's a 1963. But it's just too much gone. Um... You'd have to get rid of that nail pull, and it just ain't worth even trying to fix. It's not. So I'm gonna, what I'm going to do is grind this pin down, punch it out, and put this one in there, replace the pin. It's going to be a fun little project now. Usually when you find these, the springs are broke. But you can see it needs to be cleaned, and we're just going to give it a good cleaning. I'm going to take it over here on the fiber wheel and clean it up first before we change the blade. And here's the blade we're replacing it with. It's a 1971. I'm going to give it a new edge. Try to even that out some. Somebody went in over that. See how uneven it is right there? We're going to redo it. Okay, we're about to grind that head down with that pin, and we're going to try to punch it out. Is right there. I'm gonna try to get pull it out with the pliers now. There it is. Okay. Get that out of the way. Get this broken blade. Now, get that little bit of ground with off of the fiber wheel real quick. All right, there it is. It's all getting clean now. Okay, first, we're going to spray a little bit of oil just to help it. Big pins left. I got a bunch of 
other pins. I'm gonna try to make work. I didn't realize I needed to order some pins. So, I gotta order some pins today. But we're gonna try to make these work here. It really helps when you got long pins. Same to this side. There it is, guys. Just like that. All right. Let's see if it's going to work. Awesome. That's awesome. Okay, so now, guys, you gotta do is pull this down as far as we can and make a mushroom head like this and pull it all the way down, cut it short enough off, and make a mushroom head over here. First of all, guys, I'm gonna sand this down some. You see, it's not a flat tip. Well, I always like to start with a flat tip. I just gotta sand that down some. Just like that. Now, we got to cut this and do the same thing over here. Okay, now guys, we're going to be opening up the package all the way from Fullerton, California, from Mr. Michael Roberts. Okay, I didn't see a note from Mr. Roberts, but this is a trade that he, he, he did send me an email. He wanted to know if I want to trade this knife for a buck 301. I'm going to be sending it directly from buck to him. But check this thing out. Ain't that beautiful, y'all? It's a case. This is a 2017. Let's see if I'm right. 
Yeah, 2017. How about that? This thing's in great shape. Beautiful knife. Stainless steel trapper. Ain't that awesome, guys? I'm going to be sending him a buck 301 this coming week. Straight from Buck. And he threw these knives in. This... I'm going to say it's an Imperial. I'm going to say right there. It's a Hawk Bill. Ain't that cool? There's a main blade right there. Yep, Imperial. And that stamp right there that you see, they use that stamp all the way from 1956 all the way up to 1988. I'm going to say this is a, probably a 70s or 80s knife here. Check that blade out. It's missing the corkscrew. But other than that, this is a jam up knife. Got a hawk bill, it's got a punch blade. Got that little bitty, that's like a spade blade right there. I love that hawk bill right there. Ain't that cool? It's a very good utility knife. Awesome, buddy, thank you. And this looks like an automatic knife. I wonder if I can. Get it open here. There we go. Whoa. That's a Schrade Cutlery Company. Schrade Walden, New York. Check that out, y'all. Ain't that awesome? I hear it locking. You know what? I'm just gonna put some oil on this real quick. Let me put this. But ain't that a beautiful knife? I love that tree. Got that good carbon steel in there. That thing is sharp as a razor now. Yes, that spring. I don't know how they work. This thing. I see that that's working right there, but it's just missing that spring or something the spring don't work that's a very cool knife i've never seen one of these before fishtail awesome buddy thank you for these knives michael sent those knives all the way from fullerton california 2206 miles away from ellaville georgia Michael, thank you for those uh, other knives, man. I appreciate the trade. I'm ordering your buck 301 today, buddy. It should be there next week sometime. Appreciate it so much. God bless you. Okay, guys, here it is. The U.S. Military Camillus. See that pen I replaced right there? Looks pretty good, don't it? And check this blade out. I reshape that edge, and that joker is sharp as a razor now. See, it had a little ding in it. I wasn't going to go down any further. I got it where you can barely notice that, Nick. It was a little indention right there, but I got it out with no problem. But I'm going to tell you what, guys. As strong as these springs are and as sharp as this blade is, you got to watch yourself because it will cut you. But that is a beautiful knife. I'm fixing to hone it in a little bit more with this just trying to get the burrs off on that sander
<laughs> Telling you guys. Woo. Hear that? That's perfect. I cleaned up the other blades too. Hear that snap? Ain't nothing wrong with this knife now. Punch blade looks good. Can opener. Sounds good. Mm. I love that bell on there. Ain't that awesome, guys? So awesome. Glad I could fix this. I appreciate Mr. Ed Edward from Tennessee sending this blade in, too. But I'm telling you guys, that is a sharp blade now. Beautiful. Ain't it? Well, guys, I hope y'all enjoyed the video today. I've just had a good old time repairing that knife here, replacing the blade. Uh, and I appreciate the trade from Mr. Michael. Robert from Fullerton, California. I appreciate those other two knives too, buddy. Uh, but I will be ordering your Buck 301 today. Uh, so uh, you should have it next week sometime. Depends on how fast they get it out. Uh, but thank you again. Appreciate that trade. I love that case knife. Beautiful knife. But anyway, guys, don't forget about the giveaway. Monday night, 6.30 p.m., April 15th. We're going to be giving some good stuff away. So I can't wait for that. I just want to thank all y'all guys uh, for tuning in today. I just want to appreciate all the support, all the views, all my subscribers. Thank y'all so much. I appreciate it very much. So, and uh, But anyway, guys, I just want to say uh, God bless y'all. And until we meet again, guys, y'all be like a good night. Special.